So, Mr. Sinan, I want you to tell me about your past. I want to find out about the indentureship era. Mm -hmm. And what stories did your grandfather or father tell you? You know, oral history sometimes mm -hmm. passed on mm -hmm. from one person mm -hmm. to the next. Do you know where your ancestors came from in India? Yes, my ancestors came from Pune. From Pune and from Pune, um, they w went to Fiji. And my father was born in Fiji on the way to Trinidad. Right? So he was born there. I don't know if he was born on the boat or on Fiji itself. But he was born there, not in India. After my grandmother had left and grandfather had left India to come to the when they were recruited or when they come in voluntarily. Mm -hmm. I am not too sure. All right. You remember what caste they belong to? You know, right now we talk about Chachri and right, right, right. Brahmin. And I, I think because of the name, Sinanan, but I doubt that it was Sinanan. Somebody spoke to me and said it was Shivanan. So I am not too sure. You know, the spelling would often become corrupted, you know, when they write right. it down. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I, I don't know. I think that um, from, they were not uh, the, of the higher class and so on, like the Maharaj and so on. I think they were more like um, shepherds, like Ahir, if you know the, the term. The, 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 uh, farmers, as it were. All right. You remember what estate your father or grandfather ever told you? What estate they worked on? You know? Yes, yes, yes. When they came here, they came to Forest Park. Now they came with with a group of people that they were, or they made friends, but they were accustomed to before they boarded the ship. And after they boarded the ship, of course, you make friends on a long journey, right? And then they have. Uh, my father's mother's sisters and uh, they went to Sani Grandi side, the estate in Sani Grandi. And my father came to the estate with his mother in Forest Park. Right? Now, Sani Grandi was the cocoa area. So they let down their bar, uh, buckets in the cocoa area and they learned everything about the cocoa and coffee and all the different um, plants and so on that goes there. In fact, they came such a way that after a while they bought an estate, a cocoa estate. And that estate, that's, 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 they live, I don't know if you know the, the church, the Roman Catholic church in San Miguel Grande. They live just at the side of the um, church. Right. Right. The church has a DVD here. Yeah. My. Yeah, yeah, right, right. Yeah, she became a Catholic because the church being at the. Who was Ruby? Your sister? My, my, uh, my, and other cousin. Okay. But I can tell you when. Yeah, Babula. But they have other people there. Was she related to Reverend Babula? No, no, no. They have other people there, you know, that um, they say they are brothers and sisters. But that was the real term of Jahajivai. Mm. They considered themselves brothers and sisters. I'm telling you, right? Now, my father had a, a friend living in um, Kunupia side, Kunupia Rome. They used to call him Damadol, which is the Hindi word for tomatoes, <laughs> right? And that's that nickname? And they give him that name. So that he carried that title? He carried Damadol, yeah, Damadol. No, not as a title. Uh -huh. Everybody knew him as Damadol. Right. Now, they considered my father a brother. But I think that they were Jahaji Bai. Right. And um, he, on weekends or once a month, mm -hmm. He had a mule cart, a mule and the cart where they used to, that area where he lived was a cane area. 
So he transported cane, labor in work, and so on like that. And he used to leave on a Sunday morning, very early, before sunup, and travel from there with his mule cart to come to visit us down here, to spend the day with my father. Right. And he will go back 